Welcome back guys in this WooCommerce tutorial series. My name is Rana and you are watching WooCommerce tutorial. In this particular video, you will learn how to create or add grouped product, virtual product, downloadable products and of course affiliate product on your e-commerce website. Before you watch this video, make sure you set up your WooCommerce plugin properly. If you want to learn how to set up WooCommerce plugin properly, make sure you check out the WooCommerce basic setup tutorial from the tutorial series of WooCommerce. You can find that video link in the description box of this video or you can click somewhere around here. And if you haven't subscribed to this channel yet, please subscribe to the channel and don't forget to press that bell icon. So with that, whenever I upload a new video, you will get notified. And don't forget to hit the like button, that would be appreciated. So without wasting more time, let's get started. Alright guys, so first of all, we will learn how to create or add a grouped product on your e-commerce website with WooCommerce plugin. To create a grouped product, let's hover your mouse over products and click on add new. So first you have to type in the product name. Obviously, let's type in iPhone 11. Scroll down here. You have to type in the product description, long tail description, something like that. And then scroll down. So under the product data, we have to select grouped product you can type in the sku number if you have otherwise you can leave it blank scroll down below you have to type in the product description let's come to the right side you have to select the product image you can upload image if you want i already have this image so i'm gonna select that click on set product image below you can select product gallery images again i have only one image right now just for demonstration purposes i'm gonna select that click on add to gallery scroll up here you can type in the product tags let's type something like iphone 11 iphone right so under the product category you can add this product under any category of your product if you don't have right category you can create a new one by clicking on add new category since i already have this category so i'm going to select that and scroll up and let's hit publish let's view the product so you can see we have this product name we have short description and we have long tail description over here and one thing we are missing which is price don't worry you will see price over here once we fully completed this product just keep watching what i'm doing you will learn how to create a grouped product let's go ahead and create more products hover your mouse over here and click on products or you can go to products and add new both work the same way let's type the product name this time 64 gigabyte now scroll down you don't have to type in the full description or short description just come over here under the product data and make sure simple product should be selected and here you have to type in the product price so in indian rupees i'm gonna type in 65,000. below you can type in the sale price if you want i'm not gonna do it this would be taxable text class would be standard you can create different types of text class if you want to learn how to create text classes you can check out the description box of this video there you will find a video tutorial for that okay next we have inventory tab here you can type in the sq number if you have otherwise you can leave it blank next we have manage stock you can manage stock if you want i'm not gonna do it next we have shipping you can type weight dimension or shipping class whatever you want to do it you can do it from here let's say this would be a uh, 500 grams uh, you, type in, you can type in the dimension something like length width height there is a separate video for advanced shipping and basic shipping you can check out that video as well in the description box of this video anyways i'm gonna leave it as it is you can create attributes for this particular products like you can create uh, color attributes or you can create uh, different types of variation for this particular product or any kind of product if you want to learn more about variations or how to create attributes you can check out other videos i already created that video for you guys you will find that video as well in the description box of this video anyways scroll down let's set the product image let's go with the same image set product image scroll up select this category and most important thing is you have to edit this catalog visibility click on edit select hidden click OK and then hit publish and that's it now we are going to create another product let's go ahead click on 
add new. This time, we will type in 128 gigabyte. We don't need full description, we don't need short description, just type in the price 75,000. Again, you don't have to change anything over here, but you can do it if you want. There is a separate video like I mentioned earlier. So right now, scroll down, select the product image, scroll up, add this product into its respected category. Next, edit the catalog visibility, select hidden, click OK and hit publish. Once you do it, let's have your mouse over products, all products. Now let's edit your grouped product. Click on edit. Now scroll down under the product data. You can see this group product is selected. Now go to linked tab here under the grouped product. Search for your 64 gigabyte and 124 gigabyte product. Type in 64 gigabyte and then 128 gigabyte. So we have added two products into this grouped product section. Once you do it, scroll up and hit update. Now let's view the product. So as you can see, there is a price range between 65,000 to 75,000. If you scroll down, you can see we have 64 gigabyte version and we have 128 gigabyte version. If someone wants to buy 64 gigabyte, they can select the quantity and click on add to cart. Now, if you hover your mouse over here, you can see we have 64 gigabyte iPhone selected. People can buy this product from their checkout page. Okay, so this is how you can do it. So this is how you can create a grouped product with WooCommerce plugin for your e-commerce website. You can create different types of variations if you want. You can add different types of color for this iPhone. You can create different types of uh, memory sizes, so on and so forth, right? Now let's go to the dashboard. All right, so now I'm going to show you how you can create a virtual product with WooCommerce plugin. To do it, let's have you mouse over plugins and click on add new. Here you can type in the product name. So I'm going to type in WordPress management service. Next, you can type in the full description. Okay, this is a dummy text. Scroll down. Now, this time product data, simple product should be selected. And here you can check this option, virtual products. You can type in the price. So this WordPress management service will cost 6,000 rupees. And next, scroll down. You can type in the short description. You can add the product image. Let's go ahead, select this image and click on set product image. Scroll up. You can type in the product tags. You can type WordPress or you can type in something like service. Whatever tag you want to add, you can type in over here. And let's add this virtual product under this category. I'm going to type in something like service, WordPress service and click on add new category. And finally, all you have to do is click on publish your virtual product will be published and now let me tell you how to create a downloadable product to do it create a new product and type the product name something like ebook or other types of project files that people can download once you type the product name over here scroll down type in the description below that under the product data simple product should be selected uncheck this option and select downloadable and here you have to type in the product regular price and sale price whatever you want to type in just type in over here below that you have to select the downloadable file let's say you are selling ebooks go ahead click on add file choose file select that ebook that you have or you can upload your ebook from here let's say this is the ebook okay let's insert the url and downloadable limits you can type the downloadable limits unlimited would be fine you can type in the expiry date uh, let's say 20 days or 25 days or 30 days so i'm gonna leave it as it is this file will not be expire okay next this would be taxable or non-taxable it's all up to you below that you can type in the short description you can select the product image if you're selling ebook select the first page of your ebook or any other ebook product image scroll up and here make sure you add that downloadable products into any product category you have if you don't have you can create a new one by clicking on add new category make sure you type in the product tags which is very important people can navigate on your website by typing that keywords once you do it don't forget to click on publish let's view the product 
So this is how you can create a downloadable products on your e-commerce website. So now I'm going to show you how you can create affiliate products with WooCommerce plugin on your e-commerce website. Before we create affiliate products, let's understand what is affiliate product. For example, you are promoting Amazon product. In return, you will get some commission to promote that Amazon product. You will get commission by promoting Amazon product only if you have joined Amazon affiliate program. Once you join Amazon affiliate program or any other company's affiliate program, you will get affiliate link. Once you have that link, then you can create affiliate product on your e-commerce website. I assume you already have some affiliate links. If you have affiliate links and you have joined some affiliate programs, let's start creating affiliate products. To do it, let's have your mouse over here and click on products. So here under the product name, I'm going to type in iPhone 11, scroll down, type in the product description. This is a long tail description, scroll down under the product data. Now this time we will go with external affiliate products. So here you have to type in your affiliate product link below. You can type in the button text, type something like check it on Amazon below. You can type in the product price 65,000 or you can leave it blank if you want. It doesn't really matter at this point. Okay. Scroll down here. You can type in the short description right side. We have product image. Let's select that scroll down product gallery images. Same image would go there. Scroll up. We have product tags. Let's type in the product tags. iPhone 11 iPhone. Let's add this product under this category or you can create a new category for your affiliate products. Let's type in affiliate products click on add new add new category and scroll up finally click on publish let's go ahead view the product so now we have successfully created this affiliate product if someone click over here they will go to the amazon and from there you can see this is my affiliate link if someone will buy this product i will get some commission so that's it that's the end of this video guys i hope you learned something from today's video if you really did, don't forget to hit the like button that would be appreciated and make sure you check out other WooCommerce tutorial down below of this video. That being said, goodbye and I'll catch you guys in the next video.